Well, hundreds of Boy Scouts took over USI today for the 25th year of Merit Badge University. It's a day of fun and learning, but this year there was something a little different. I went as soon as Amelia Young has more on this historic day. They're eager to learn things. They are eager to, um, to share their knowledge. Today, a group of local girls made history. Watching them do it throughout the day, they were having just as much fun as, this, as the, boys, the boys were. In. in a crowd of hundreds, they stood out, attending Boy Scouts of America's Merit Badge University, not as visitors, but a part of the troop. February 1st was, was uh, the date when uh, girls could actually join um, a scouting movement, a scouting program. When the organization made the historic decision to welcome girls into their youth program, a handful of girls here in the Tri-State jumped on the opportunity. <laughs> it was like a privilege. Yeah. Because yeah. 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 we're the only girl troop here. Most of us have like either a dad or a brother in Boy Scouts, so we've kind of just grown up with it. Mm -hmm. And just to be able to do it now just with us, it's a lot, it's better. We're not, we can do more. They spent their day participating in the first aid class, getting hands-on valuable experience. That's, that's the beauty of it. Is they're, they're in there doing the same thing that the boys have been doing for all these years, and they're really enjoying it. They're having a ball. While the organization's decision came with controversy, the girls say the opportunity is life-changing. It's a learning experience. It's like, it's, almost, it's like once in a lifetime. If you only get one chance to really prove yourself, prove to yourself that you can do it. In Evansville, Amelia Young, Eyewitness News.